This is a quilt I've made for my little nephew. When it was his birthday in November, it's now nearly April, I said, what would you like for your birthday? And he said, and I was expecting something like Lego Auntie Tracy. He said, a quilt. I was like, seriously, a quilt? So I said, would you like the bug quilt? Nah. Would you like the robot quilt? Nah. He said, I want one with lots of different colors. He said, can I look on Pinterest? I was like, yeah, sure you can. You can look on Pinterest. So he went through my Pinterest boards and um, liked all the scrappy ones. I said, like, do you not want one of Aunt Tracy's designs? No, they're not for me. <laughs> Which was just hilarious. So um, I said, like, right, well, I'll, um, I'll have to make you a quilt then. And I'd got this quilt top that I'd made ages ago. So I showed him a picture and he said, oh, I love it. It's only little. So this is the quilt top. It's made out of all blue scraps, as you can see. I think these are eight inch squares that I've made and then piece them all together. I don't know if you can hear that engine going in the background. We have to generate our own electricity on the boat. So I have to put the engine on and um, it's quite noisy. I have to turn the revs up. So that's the front. And then I've quickly pieced together. And this is the back. So I quickly pieced this together the other evening. Green is his favourite colour, but he obviously likes blue. So these are four inch squares and it was great to use up my stash. I think I used up lots of odds and ends and bits of fat quarter. not sure yet how I'm going to quilt this. I'll probably do a stipple quilt meander. Simple little meander. I like the back of this. Sometimes just the simplest squares have such a great effect. And it didn't take me long. It took me longer to choose which greens to use, to be honest. So if you're still watching by now, you're just watching a woman iron a quilt on a narrowboat in a very small space. I've not decided which binding I'm gonna use yet. I think it might have to be blue. Perhaps a dark navy blue. Or I might make a scrappy binding. I'll see what I've got, I've got loads got too much fabric. So the wadding that I'm using for this is Vlyzeline 8020 and I don't use pins. I don't like using pins. So I spray based and I use the Odif 505 temporary adhesive. I've tried lots of different ones. This is my favourite. I always go back to it, so, so I don't even bother trying any others now. Right, there we go.